All right, we are, excuse me, we're going to go ahead and through in the uh, Rubank elementary method for, for clarinet, we're, all, we're going to go ahead and attack lesson 28, 16th notes. Back anytime you're playing clarinet, you're going to be playing clarinet with fast air. Um, the, the mental pitch you, you ought to be getting is, is getting air from here right through to your bell onto the floor as if you were blowing out a candle on the floor. And it's the best way to get, I found, to get notes to respond. All right, uh, we're going to start on lesson 28, number one. The rhythm is one to and two and one to, one to and two and one to and two and one and two. Not too fast. One. Two, ready? Great. Now, if and if for some reason. That's too fast. Slow it. Stop the video. Slow it down and try it again. Okay. All right. Now the rhythm in number two is is similar. The thing that isn't similar is the key. The key is in the key of C, and that means there are no flats or sharps. So we're going to have to make sure that we play B natural when it's time to play B natural. Oh, before we do. When you're playing notes that have the, the register key and involve the right hand, be very careful that this finger right here doesn't do this or that. But on the, on the C key, the tendency to lift up and move up towards your nose and opens the hole and makes it impossible for the notes to come out. We'll make sure that we're covered up on the bottom there. All right, number two, lesson 28. One, ready, go. flubble there. Good. All right, number three. Notice that in number three, we have a different key signature. We have B flat and E flat. So we are probably in the key of B flat. The key of B flat has two flats, both B flat and E flat. So be, be very sure that you remember to play the E flat. That's the one that people normally forget. Here we go. One, ready? <laughs> Played it too fast, just slow down, stop the video, slow down, and try it again. You should have at least two tempos when you're working on anything. You should have a practice tempo and a performance tempo. And you and, and what you will take the practice tempo and you will move it closer and closer as you get better and better to a performance tempo. Okay. You're not going to learn something as fast as, you, as you're going to perform it. You're going to learn something technical slower. And then you're going to speed it up, speed it up until you get to that performance tempo. All right, number four, we're going to play it at more of a, a, a practice or a rehearsal tempo the first time and then a performance tempo the second time. It's great because it's just an exercise on an F scale, which means it only has one flat. There aren't any accidentals, um, and the rhythm is fairly consistent. Here we go. Number four, lesson 28. 
Once that's solid, once that tempo is solid and you're comfortable with it, then you would uh, crank up the metronome just a little bit. Maybe one or two clicks, maybe eight metronome markings, four or eight metronome markings, for instance, from 80 to 84 or from 60 to 64. And then the next one from 60 to 68 and then from 68 to 72 and so on. We're gonna play this, uh, this time a little closer to what would be a performance tempo. One, two. so much for what you're doing continue to practice every day work on your sound work on work on your technique work on the things that we talked about keeping your fingers really close to the to the instrument as close as possible technically your fingers shouldn't have to come up any further than than, than where the keys come up so when the rings come up your fingers should technically stop or close to that right um, make sure that happens make sure your thumb stays under the thumb rest here and doesn't ride here and end up like this on the other side, but it makes it hard to play. Um, what else? Make sure your teeth stay on top of the mouthpiece. Make sure that you keep your chin pointed straight down, you see, and, you, and your ambiture stays kind of, I don't want to say tight, but kind of firm um, and, mo and move the air fast. You should have great success. Thank you ever so much. Uh, until we see until we see you again, keep playing.